Hi, I'm in the Maidstone Museum, and I'm going to show you what we've what we've got in Maidstone on for leisure. And this is one of eight leisure things we got, but this is just been the museum blog. We're in the shop at the moment. Um, you can't do everything at the moment. You can't do Egyptian and Explorer because of it's too narrow. These are quite interesting. I wouldn't mind buying some of these. Old photos of Maidstone. Nice. These are photos of Maidstone again, really. That building's totally changed now. I don't even think it's the original building there no more. But a lot of that's still there. That high street is still very similar, apart from the end building. Quite a lot of good artwork actually, showing mates in history. There is. Some other bits and pieces you can buy. And you have to follow the arrows around. It's a one-way system, like a lot of places is now. So, we will show this. So, this is the Mason Museum. If you didn't guess it, there you are. Alright. One way. This is, this is gorgeous. This is. We've got some really nice artwork in here as well. I'm not sure if we can do the artwork. Bare picture of her. As you can see up there. I'm not sure, but I may be the only person in the museum. This part is the war part. See? Queen's own Royal West Kent Regiment Museum. I used to come here all the time. There we are. I mean, look at that. No, that's poor and sank. Got the old flags in here of the regiment. As you can see. No, that's really old. Buckles and belts, and a couple of medals. It's funny thing, every time I was a kid here, I used to always look to see if they had any fennels, and well, <laughs> there were never any fennels. They weren't. Hello, sorry, officers. Yeah, definitely officer. There we are. I mean, you can still get some of these. 
Uh, there's a lot of moss produced. Um, you know, obviously the uniform's not that great. So, but like, if anything like these, you know, you can still get them. Nice old artwork. Nice old fireplace, actually. Can you imagine that lit up? And look at them old tiles. There's the back of the cannon, but I'll show you better in a minute. I mean, it's really nice museum. See? Now we're coming to what I call 19th century. Nice lot of medals. They are nice. I mean, that's interesting. That's gorgeous, that is. Imagine walking out of that one. <laughs> you would like to feel like a peacock. I mean, look at that. I like how they show things off as well. I believe that flag has had its day. Uh, so it's that one. But obviously, they're the really old flags. Uh, I wonder what happened to it. Is that the cannon? But I don't think so. Hmm. We all recognise that dog, don't we? Green gun. And a Smith uh, the German gun. I can't actually remember the name at the moment. Cross with the names of the people that have lost their lives. I mean, can you see the artwork on that? I mean, you think just a weapon of war. Could have been playing as anything, but this made it look like, you know, it's got artwork on it. As you can see, I mean, you know, it's interesting. Right, we're out of that pit and now into what I call the old part of the museum. The original part. I mean, that's a model of the museum actually. Quite nice. Oh, is that sure? I mean, I thought he's been there for donkey years. He has. I'm not the only person in there. I can hear that now. <laughs> oh, got some more. Look, but don't touch. <laughs> There's definitely a lot of these signs around. Alright, we're from the arrows. You can see the arrows on the floor. So we're going out of this bit now, and we're going upstairs. I mean, look at that original entrance there. We won't be able to meet the people of Greece or ancient Egypt. Well, it's too narrow. Now we got the stairs. We're upstairs now. I mean, just and oh. Oh, squeaky. Have I came into the light? Yes, I did. Nice old cannon. Right. 
we'll be going that way in a minute. Oh. I mean, can you see the room? I mean, it's gorgeous. I mean, look at that. Flexing the swords. Hmm. Right. Right, we're going to go this way. Hmm. Our weapons. And now we're going into here. They see the dinosaurs. Oh. <laughs> All right, maybe not. This bit might be a bit screamy for some people, so uh, miss this bit out. A lot of these are really old. Uh, I've not been done like now. Done 50, 100 years and so. You know, done quite some time ago, I do remember that. And still look pretty good. Except from the bobcat. That's probably why he's up the corner. I said dinosaurs. There we are. The dinosaurs it used to be actually the birds area, actually. See? Old fossil bones and a badger. Hello, badger. That old egg. No, I didn't think you can go out there no more. You better walk all along here. But that was many years ago. Right, we're gonna go down. This way. I mean, it is interesting. They try to follow the times, really, and that's the only way. Sometimes it is. Oh, last time I came in here must be two, three years, I suppose. You know, long time. You've come in here quite regular when the library is next door, but. Alright. I mean, look at that. That's the guy who found that lot. I mean, it's interesting. Alright, let's go to the next bit. But I didn't miss them. Look how big they are. Because imagine keeping your head up. Whew. Back in that room again, we'll be going over to the Japanese area and then we'll be going downstairs. Better place to look at this fireplace. I mean, obviously, haven't been used for about 50 years, probably. Very squeaky in here. 
Oh, blimey. All right, we're coming into the artwork gallery. And they have got Maidstone has got some really nice artwork actually. And also, it's, well, like I've always said, art is the eye of the older. I mean, I quite like that. I mean, that's a nice one as well. All right, we go up. We're going in that room in a minute. I mean, I think there used to be more artwork, if I remember rightly. I mean, look at this one. I mean, that's gorgeous. Well, I bet you, at some point, it was a lot lighter. I mean, it is nice. And that's old, I would say, that's Maidstone. Yep, no, he even says that. See, another grand old uh, fireplace. Mm hmm. Right. Now we're in uh, that apartment. I've got the cabinets I want. I'll go for there for the Gurkhas. This is in here for a little while. Nepanese. Um, don't see any arrows, but I will have a look. Range of outfits they wear. And dolls. Right, let's go into this bit here. I mean, these are quite nice. I mean, look at that. But I would never be, you know, climbing Mount Everest. Oh. Gurkha's outfits, they've done a lot for us, they have, over the years. Well then, uh, can't say the same about us for them. And now we're in the Japanese section. Dad would have loved this part. I mean, look at that, it's gorgeous. And you can see outside. I mean, that's nice as well. We have got an Egyptian ring and that, but sadly, like I said, they are closed. We will be going downstairs in a minute. We are nearly done for upstairs. I mean, let's look at that. Uh, Japanese and you know, I all believe in doing artwork. I mean, really nice. You need to come to make some sound up with it for yourself. Videos don't do this stuff justice at times. They don't. And it'll take you no more than if you browse it, first timer, probably about an hour. You know, so. But yeah. Right. We are going to go downstairs now. Here we are. Right, we are about to go downstairs now. Here we are. Down the old stairwell. The amount of times I've been up this in the when I used to come in here regular. Well then, I was coming here regular. I did. Yeah. 
As you can see, this is local history of Maidstone and probably surrounding areas as well. Any arrows on the floor? Not to see, but I'll see what I aren't. Oh, stamps or sills. I mean, that's an interesting bike. I wouldn't mind it actually. Not a bit, it's heavy. I haven't got a trainer. Very interesting picture. That's Maidstone East. With people getting off, and there we are. And here's the details about it. Leave it there for a couple of seconds so you can read it or just pause it. Alright, I'll we'll go around there. Old Stein Winch pub sign. Obviously, they uh, denoted it to them and they changed the sign. Old trams and buses. Bombing. I mean, it's interesting. I mean, look at that fender machine. Very nice. Section of old tins, like I said to you. Sharks, battles used to be here. As you can see. Now we're at Feminines. That's why Feminines Sports called Feminines, because it's the old brewery. Some nice old signs. I'm not sure where that is. Probably we'll find out in a second. It's actually a padded cell door, that is. And that's is in at his muggies or mulligans, the pub. So that's what it was before it turned into that. Uh, that's up my way. That is. Well, not no more. Do hops and that. I mean, there is some nice, you know. Some pictures. That is like Maidstone Museum, actually. Yep. Yeah. Blackout curtains that he's meant to have. Ice cream thing. <laughs> I mean, that's really interesting. Uh, as you see, there's an arrow, so we're now walking through here. We're going into the dressing rooms. I hope there's men's <laughs> toys that I collect, but not fists that. Nice old fashioned toys. They were built the last, some of them was. But anything can be destroyed. Uh, if you're rough on your toys, you can break them. Women outfits, old nylons. I think at the moment we're in what I call the ladies area. Imagine having that on all the time. I think that's for a pregnant lady. So as you can see, the 1890s was a bit restricted for you ladies. It was. Yeah. I mean, blimey. You couldn't have a quick, <laughs> yeah, I won't say anything, but you probably know what I'm saying. Uh -huh. Now we are, I think we're in 1920s, I would say. 
1920. Yeah, 1900s, 19, yeah, so we are coming up 1920s. Thought so. Now we're coming to more modern times. Blimey. Bit of tickles, isn't it? And there's nothing in that corner. And, well, it's out. In the old path section. All right, All right we needed that bit there first. Fancy toilet. And some old bits and pieces. Make some public baths. Wasn't in here when I was born. I believe we got knocked down quite some time ago. But I was born in there. Now we know what I call the last bit. And after this, we're out. And this is basically uh, the bridge, I suppose. And again, look at that clock. I mean, clock. I mean, fireplace and a clock. You can see over the years how the bridge has changed. Those, them windows are not there no more. They are long gone. They are. Hmm, quite interesting. Let's see the old Simon Winch Brewery at one point. Yep. There we are. And basically, bridge manage, that is Chatham at the moment, as you can see. Are they repairing it? Yep, I've spotted that one. Right. Hmm. Right, we can go out now. And now I go out. That's the missing done. This used to be the old calf. Obviously not used no more. Right, we're back in the courtyard now. The original entrance was here. And that's the Mason Museum done for you. As you can see, the original entrance. And then there's Family Walk. That's the outside of it. As you can see, it's quite big. Not everything's open, but then it's the time of the times. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video of the Mason Museum. Uh, first timer, you might need an hour and a bit. Uh, but if you've been there many times, like you see, it takes 40 minutes. And um, it can be a bit quicker. Anyway, like my video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and there will be more videos coming soon. Alright, I'm for now. Bye!